41 NBC AccuWeather Forecast. Well, it is a bit of a moody Monday out there for us. We have a lot of cloud cover, as you can see here in Macon with our 41 Skyview camera from the top of the Piedmont Macon Medical Center. We are currently sitting at 81 degrees and it's still pretty humid out there. 82% right now, but those clouds don't look to be budging at all around the region. 79 for us in Sandersville right now and our warm spot currently. Well, that is Eastman. We are sitting Sitting at 84. As for sky conditions, now we have a really good look at all this cloud cover around the area, but we're not seeing any rain as of yet. I'll have details coming up on what to expect in terms of rain at seven miles per hour and it's good to see a bit of that sunshine and despite all the cloud cover we are still seeing a lot of heat today it's a 94 in Dublin and Eastman those are our hot spots for this afternoon the cool spot that is Forsyth at 88 degrees over in Monroe County but as we go forward we're gonna see some changes to our forecast the clouds not going anywhere couple of isolated storms will be possible as we get into the dinner time hours today, but not everybody's going to be seeing those as we continue through the overnight hours. The cloud cover does not budge and then we get the main wave of storms as we head into the lunchtime hours tomorrow. There's a possibility that some of those could be strong to severe and of course these are associated with the remnants of Ida. They could last with us into tomorrow night as we head to bed and we still might see some spotty showers as we head out the door for work and school on Wednesday morning. But as we go through the day Wednesday, especially getting late in the afternoon, we should start to see some of those clear out. So for tonight, still going to be pretty humid and mild, rather warm out there. 72 for Warner, Robbins and Perry. You've got 73 in Dublin and Eastman. Our cool spot again, that will be for Scythe at 70 degrees. But tomorrow, big changes. These are a lot cooler. 84 for Gordon and Macon as well as Sanderson. We're seeing high Highs in the 70s tomorrow. Warner, Robbins, and Forsyth both up to 78. That's going to give us a nice break from that heat. And of course, when you start seeing a break from that heat, we start seeing the humidity potentially go down as well, especially as Ida begins to leave the picture. And so as we leave, see that humidity begin to drop down, temperatures might still be hot. It's going to feel a little bit better outside as we head towards the weekend. We're going to take a peek at that in 10 seconds with your seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, good oil changes for life, plus a 20-year, 200,000-mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I-75, exit 187 in Forsyth. That's VolumeChevrolet.com. And here is your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast brought to you by Volume Chevrolet. You see temperatures getting cool early on in the week and then we do warm back up. But what I want to draw attention to is those lows. You see those getting down into the mid 60s as we head into the weekend. That shows that drop in humidity. Things are going to feel pretty pleasant, though still a bit hot as we head into a sunny weekend once Ida passes. For weather updates on the go, download the 41NBC AccuWeather app and follow 41NBC on Facebook and Twitter. Weather brought to you by Volume Chevrolet and Versailles.